What's up everyone, Ryan here, and it is time for a brand new Ryan Gamer Career Mode series on the channel. We are stepping into the world of NHL in NHL 24, be a pro career mode. I am so pumped for this series. Ryan Gamer, the multi-sport athlete on the channel, has been playing at a high level across all the sports, but he struggles in sports where he has to play defense, and I know that's quite a bit of them, right? <laughs> but... The last series we did was NHL 21. It's been about three years. And in that series, Ryan Gamer played some great defense. So I think NHL is one of his best sports. We will see. But stay tuned for a full series here for NHL 24. I will link a playlist to you all in the description where you can check out all the videos in this series. Because depending on when you're watching it, the series could already be live. Get some enjoyment, drop a like, it really helps the channel, and subscribe for more. But it is time for us to start our journey in NHL 24 Be A Pro Mode. NHL Super Agent Taylor Mackey joins us here on the line who represents the hottest, most anticipated prospect in years. Taylor, give us some 411 on the kid here. Hey, morning, James. Well, look, you may not believe this, but the kid's up here on Carter Lake. What? Playing pickup, yeah, with a bunch of other kids just a beautiful day pricey pond hockey you got going there <laughs> yeah, yeah i suppose it is but look that's how much this kid loves the game man well just safety first up there now of course i, I gotta ask you we we've seen the scouting reports we've seen the highlights but we know about the player but tell me more about the person what's this rookie really like yeah sure james uh, let's begin by telling your listeners at home the kid's name so we have to say it that intro has been the same, I feel like, for the past six years. And I don't think I'm over-exaggerating. Let's go ahead and create Ryan Gamer. So here is NHL 24 version of Ryan Gamer, number 12, left-handed shooter, 6'2", 225 pounds, and are we a fighter? You better believe it. Often fighting, and of course, from Florida, Okay, so here we go. Choosing our archetype. I feel like I'm always a sniper, so I think that's what I'm going to choose. But let's take a look at him. Sniper, playmaker, power, two-way, grinder, or enforcer. It, you already know. It's got to be sniper. That's what we do. That's my play style. Zone ability, 1T. Those Alexander Ovechkin there. That's what we're going to know. Our fighting skill is not going to be great, but I never said we were a good fighter. It just said that we fight often. <laughs> okay, so where do we want to go? Where do we want to start our journey? And the last time we started all the way back, so we could start in the CHL's Memorial Cup. Memorial Cup tournament, NHL draft, NHL preseason, NHL regular season, okay. And then we can go in Europe, Champions Hockey League playoffs. Or we can start right in the NHL. No, I don't want to do that. I definitely want to go to, through the draft. So let's do the CHL's Memorial Cup team. Okay, so we want the team who's going to win the championship. See, WHL, OHL, or QMJHL. Let's just pick the team with the best goalie. Let's just pick the best team. The Ro That's actually a cool name. The Rockets? The Tigers? The Warriors? The Winter Hawks? Now that's pretty cool. The Portland Winter Hawks. That might be what we go with. I think we've got to go with the the Portland Winter Hawks, right? Like, that's an intimidating name if I've ever seen one. The Winter Hawks? I don't know about intimidating, but it just sounds awesome. The Winter Hawks. Let's do it. So here we go. Ryan Gamer is ready for the Memorial Cup here for the Portland Winter Hawks on his journey to get drafted in the NHL. Let's go ahead and dive on in. And who better to talk about the upcoming Memorial Cup than a guy who's actually hoisted the trophy, Ray Ferraro. Does that conjure up some memories there for you? Yeah, you bet it does. What a what an awesome time in your career. You, It's the most important games that you've played in your life, really, until that time. And now for most of these players, it, it'll be the biggest games they ever play. But there's also NHL scouts here. There's draft rankings on the line. This is a fantastic tournament to play in. 1983 has been a few years. Do you still remember the moment, though? 
I do because it turned out uh, as it turned out rather that's the only tournament we ever won the only one <laughs> I was ever on the winning side of here we go you see in the in world of NHL Ryan Gamer of course has the beard he is rocking the beard and I made it to where when we make the playoffs it's gonna grow longer you gotta do that in hockey Memorial Cup round robin we want to see Ryan's first game here so it looks like you can do next game or next big event let's definitely do the next game we want to play our first game new conversation with the agent let's see what the agent has to say hey ryan you've come a long way since we met and i know this is what we've been both working so hard for this tournament is your shot at the nhl get out there and impress the scouts and i know you can go first overall Thanks for the support, Taylor. The team's been working really hard and we're going, we're ready to go all out for this tournament. That's the spirit, Ryan. Just play the way I know you can and you'll do great. Your family's supporting you too, so go out there and make them proud. You know the thing that, you know, whether it's NHL via pro mode, whether it's MLB The Show, like you compare NHL via pro for the past six years and you compare the it would be the show career mode road to the show series i think they've had the same conversations and same cutscenes for like the past five or six years and i don't think i'm over exaggerating I i'm surprised i really am but this year in this game see the, a lot of the gameplay mechanics have changed i mean the gameplay i've already played a few games and it's sick Likeability, the answers you choose will impact your player's personality and how you're perceived. The meters affected are brand management and teammates. So the usual, teammate management. Management team can be tied to team responses. Management likability affects how fast you can move up and down lines. So we need to be always about teammate. Your brand impact is how it's often tied to star responses. This affects number of followers and money earned. I'm not, a, not worried about that. Promises, challenges. What path will you take? The team and star path will give you different challenges. The team path will give you safer challenges and rewards will affect your likability and line score. Yep, we got it. Star path is set for X Factor. We definitely want the team for now. I think it's important to go with the team here for this first one. We'll go with the team and we may change it later on. Win the game. Easy enough. Yeah, we got it. We got it. Challenge accepted, win the game. Let's do quick. Here we go. I think quick for the first, you know, this is the Memorial Here Cup round we robin. Go. This should be a fun one on the ice tonight. Hi, everybody. Welcome back to EA Sports. I'm James Sabalski. Let's drop the puck. We are about set to drop the puck as both centers make their way into the dock. The Peets get off to a good start as they win the opening faceoff. We're only gonna get one shift, right? Or two shifts, probably. Let's see. Hey! Look at the winter hawks go. Here we go. Wow, we're slow. Here's a shot. A simple stop with the glove by Giannuzzi. We are. Uh, hey, I'm used to playing with NHL players. Ryan needs Lots to speed up. To be played in this period. Portland's up one zip. Off the draw, they take possession. And it's a quick pass to Ryan. I was calling for puck was the problem. Peterborough's got a hold of the puck now. One thing I will say, hitting is much harder this year. Is you, you have to like load it up and then send it. Not the greatest first season. shift. It was absolutely incredible. You're under pressure. You're under attack. Really under siege. And you find a way to get to the puck. This is the stuff that champions are made of. Beck's got the puck. And they'll go on the attack. Giannuzzi's going to elect to just hang on for the And there's the new pressure system. You can see it on the middle of the ice. On this one. He's physically engaging, keeping himself in it. And the, the go there's goalie fatigue, too. So pressure system, goalie fatigue. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. The Winterhawks move the puck in the defensive zone. Change it up! Change it up! From the Lawrence. Oh, my goodness, what a stop! Oh, that's on off the post. Simpsons last 
save was so impressive, James. Really a last-ditch effort to find the puck. And you had battled, and you had really Got to do a line saves. We almost scored. Look at the bench. Everyone is elevated because of that save. We've got to score that. It's wide open. A good cut. Good pass by the teammate. I feel like we've got to score that. 2-0, though. Let's go Winterhawks. The Winterhawks have it now. Standing by our own Carlin Bays with all the latest. Thanks so much, James. You know, the rookie is playing in his very first Memorial Cup, and the hype around social media is real. He cut off the pass. It would, the, the assist would have been open, but great defense. Great defense to cut off the pass there. Got to get that shot up there, Ryan. Like, it's wide open. Take the shot. Send it up. Peterborough's got a hold of the puck. Exploring we are so slow. The defensive zone. Gaining momentum along the wing. The Pete's gain control of the puck. Portland's looking to break out of their own end. Moves the puck up to Ryan. Couldn't catch up to that. Is that pass. Ryan? Oh, we'll get the puck. Defenders <laughs> as icing is the call. It's a bit rusty. It's his focus lately has been in NFL in Madden 24 trying to lead the Seahawks to the Super Bowl. And one thing I will say, we've never won a Stanley Cup. Ryan Gamer's never won a Stanley Cup or the Super Bowl. He's won FedEx Cups. He's won major championships in golf. He's won World Series. So he, the reason he accepted the NHL contract is he wants to win a Stanley Cup. Peterborough's going to start with the puck inside the offensive zone. Hey, block we shot. As the puck goes out of we'll play. take it. Late goings of this period. Portland's got a 2 nothing lead. Peterborough's won the draw inside the offensive zone. Now let's see what they can do with it. Just face Stop off to face off, right? Goes up and over. We'll get a face off. So many face-offs. Game feels really good this year, though. It really does. Good heads up play to sneak oh. in there on the top. What a save. Portland's got the puck at the defensive end. Ryan's got it to the side. Oh, oh what a reactionary save. You saw the new icon passing. I've wanted Game's them to add icon the passing for years. They That's finally did it. Portland's got the puck inside the defensive zone. From off the wall and onto a stick. The Winterhawks will play it from the corner. Comes up with the stop. Hey, we're doing good and passing, though. Forcing a stoppage in play. It's not all about shooting. You got to get your teammates involved. We want the stats, I know, but at the end of the day, it's playing hockey. So that's our last shift of that period. So 2 0 in the first period. Going to go into the intermission with the lead here. There's the buzzer, 20 minutes in the books, second period just around the corner. I don't know how many games we'll play in this first episode. We may play all the round robin games. Moves the puck over to Hayes. Along the right wall and into the offensive end. Shot denies him in close. This is a really nice save, James. I mean, the shooter scores on the one timer. Come on, defense. Do one. Come on, team. All right, Ryan, we're Looks putting like the pressure on them. Don't stop now. I can do that, coach. But the coach recognizes that that last shift, they built a ton of momentum, and it's about building on top of that. So having a conversation with the young rookie is just a reminder that, listen, you got to be on your toes. you got to push. you got to press. Be aggressive on the puck, and let's continue this flow of pace. We're still in the early stages of this period. The Peets have answered back in these last few minutes, but still need one more to I want to hit him so bad. And now he moves it quickly to Hayes. Takes a shot. Chianuzzi's gonna hang on for the whistle here. It's been a ho hum night for him. Well, I want to really put the has, hits has on him, you know. But it is a close game, and he's got to come up big. He has to stay dialed in and focused in this one. Centers get set as they're ready to drop the puck again. Bex won the draw, and they're on the attack. There it is. The Portland's looking to break out. 
The Winterhawks played along the wing. Blocker save it. Yes! That's an assist. Right on the doorstep. The I was trying to that. That was the Crosby pass. Pat, shoot it off the off the pads, get the rebound. That should be an assist, right? Well, he's gonna get some stick taps Definitely. for here, James. It's a desperation play. Unfortunately, he's unable to catch up to the puck. Beautiful. It wasn't off the was my shot off the post. I couldn't tell if it was off the pads and then the post. But we will take it. Now they've extended the lead to two. They're on a roll, and you can I don't know see if it gave us the assist or not. The way they're communicating on the bench when you're yes, it did. Let's go and let's take a look at that replay. Take a look at this play here. Let's take a look from Ryan's perspective here. Come on, all the way back. There we go. So coming down, we get, we did the hit right. So the hit was the big start. Boom! Right into the boards. Teammate gets it, feeds us the puck, and then we're able to skate in, skate out, skate in, and then just kind of deking around, waiting for the opening. And then end up, instead of passing it, even though I probably should have passed it, right? Cut in, defender bites hard, and then left the shot open all off the, wow, off the blocker, off the blocker, barely. I'm, honestly, Ryan should have made that shot. You can see how it's open there. Just shot it right at the blocker, deflect it off, and then the teammate grabs it. What a play. And then just puts it right back in. I think this is a good time to pause and take a screenshot here. So there we go. Ryan with this first point here in NHL 24. Yes, we're not in the NHL yet, but still. Good assist. Everything's alive. Peterborough's got the puck along. A left winger should not be cutting up that much. That's on me. And he came up with a solid stop on that play. Gianuzzi's been really sharp tonight, James, and then just have a look at his save percentage, and he's making the stops that he needs to. The man, this team's played well. They've got going north. They've created opportunities, and the reason why, they have a healthy lead. Come on, Ryan. Puck battle along the boards. And he can't hang on after that hit. Ryan's got it in the offensive zone. Gets it. Oh, almost snuck it in there. Trying to get back on the attack now. No, he was back. For the offside, we'll get a face we almost off. had full pressure there. You can see we were almost there. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period. Good pressure on the forecheck from Ryan there. Lead as they have dominated for the most I hardness. hope we get drafted to my Pittsburgh Penguins. Please get us on the Penguins. That would be awesome. Up, oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Othman. And he coughs it up with the pass. Shot. Yes. Grab that puck, Ryan. He finds it at the last minute, reacts and makes the save. Ryan stick handling in his own zone. The Winterhawks played along the boards. Beautiful read in the defensive end by Hayes. Oh, excellent play. And Good try. There. Now he takes it over the line. Quick pass to Offman. The Winterhawks have possession shorthanded. Gets it out of his own end. Good play. Good play. Scrum along the boards. They battle for the pot. Trying Good board, board pin going. there from Ryan, but we are wore out. Long road. shifts. And he shuts the Whoops. Door on oh. Here he is. All alone. Oh, and the defender had a different idea there. Now they're getting oh, mad at me. Ryan can barely skate right now. Yeah, did I have the puck too long? Probably. Is that a huge deal? I don't think so. Four to one ball game, though. I keep saying ball game. Another face <laughs> hockey game. Here on this power play. Portland's got it, and they're on the attack. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. There's a shot. Yes. Oh! Second assist. Shots on net are key. Rebound control for that goal. He's really bad right now. Hey, cheers, everybody. Get your coffee, whatever you're drinking. Let's go. Oh, Second really assist of the goal, night. James. You can Almost see the frustration made it. On his face and the body language. Just thinks he lost track of it as it found the back of the net. Almost made that. Probably should have made it. 
look at where we're at here. We're still in the late stages of the period here. Yeah, it's been an unbelievable game for them so far. I mean, they've just been so dominant offensively. It's the hip it check. Really Not a big one, but... They're trying to slow the game down, but they can't because they're just on fire in terms of pace and dictating it. That was embarrassing, right? Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. Musa quickly over to Hayes. Answered the call on that play. Giannuzzi's dialed in and able to redirect that puck to the corner. Here's the chance to the middle. Off a stick and they can't complete the play. Oh, oh a stick save. Well, he does a great job of having sound positional play based on where the puck is on that low inner spot. And he makes himself big, takes away the holes, and makes a save. Pass. Nice puck check. Oh, the thievery coming up with the puck on the play. And a solid save of the play. Long shifts, what do you want me to do? Just leave the ice right away? When we have the puck? Skate it out of the zone. Oh, love the defensive stick work there to poke that one away. Sends one up to Clausen. Fire it! Fire it! Rips it! And he hangs on! Hey, great period, right? Great period. That brings the period Another an assist. All right, third period. But like, Just around the corner, we'll get coach is mad at me for a long shift there. But what? You want me to leave the ice when we're on the more. attack in the offensive zone? That makes no sense. <laughs> that makes absolutely no sense whatsoever. Hope you're having a great night. Two periods down. One more to go. And they're ready to drop the puck here on period number three. We are underway here in the third. Let's see if there's any sort of saving face at one end of the ice. Good Two play. Two the way to the finish line, and this one for regulation time. Cheryl, how do you view it? Portland's been consistent through 40 minutes of play here, James. Good try. A comfortable lead. Now it's about bringing it home, and in order to do that, you that's make that's sure easily you're tripping. Responsible. Let's get the call. We're on the power play here. Let's capitalize. No, we're not on the power play. Now they gotta kill off a penalty when they're getting blown out. Real tough game. The Pete's will play from the defensive zone. Here they come through center and into the offensive end. We may be on power play two, right? Line two. No, we're not. Five two game. Alright. Smith's lugging the puck. The Pete's move to the offensive zone. Sends it in front. Can't connect the play. Moves it to back. Here's a shot. Scores! And a little sign of life here on the ice as they try to get back into it. Yeah, a little bit of a momentum swing right here. And now they've got a layer, which means they've got to have that next shift where they attack and have You hate to see it, the right? <laughs> you hate to see now. it. <laughs> and they take control of the puck here in the neutral zone. I feel like we played that puck pretty well, but why are you throwing that puck out? That's so dangerous. The Pete's gain possession in their own end. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Gets the puck in deep. It's so much harder to hit this year. The Pete's have it in the offensive zone. Now let's let's not throw this game, team. The game opens up here now, James, as they're within one, and if they can continue this press, they can get the equalizer. You gotta believe that they can do it right now as you feel the momentum shift. As a goaltender, you're always working on different exercise, tracking with your eyes, foot movements, everything that power pushes you across the crease, and unfortunately this time he's just too slow getting across, and it hits him and goes to the back of the net. That's heartbreaker. Come on, team, wake up. Put the hit on him. Beam in the rock. Play it in their own end. The biscuit. Pass to the oh, what a pass. Yes! Get in there. Slap shot was wide open. Ryan Gamers fired up. <laughs> yes. First go, one go, two assists, three point night, right off the blocker. The blast of the shot, it hit him. The sniper, it's what we do. Oh no, right in the gap. Beautiful. Gap between the blocker and the pads. That's how you play. 
Well, stick taps all around and even a smile Problem from the success. coach as the rookie makes his way back to the bench. A little well, yeah, old school, Ryan, but I like it. And I love that he's getting this, James, because okay. earlier they had a conversation about a specific instruction and expectations on that shift. And when you go out and you execute and then you come back to the bench and you're kind of looking at your coach and they give you that reinforcement, it's a great feeling. The Winterhawks will look to try to bring this home now, up by two in the back half of this third period, Cheryl. It's been a great game for them, James, but it ain't over yet. They've got to find a way to close this one out, and the best way to do it is when you have the puck on your stick. Don't give it up for free. Close quickly and look to attack. And there's a blocker stuck by Giannuzzi. There's the whistle. We'll get a face off. They almost had full pressure. Up. I think they're like a, mil a millisecond away from full pressure. Officials are set. Players seem ready. We're ready to get this thing. But they're probably going to get it here. Nice job tying up his opponent. Trippy. And he's taken down the official's arm, signaling for a penalty. On the attack along the boards. What kind of pass was that? Pass attempt is deflected. Wins moving the puck through his own zone. Portland's playing it through center. Jocelyn for the puck, but still moves away. Their goalie's terrible at rebound control. That's a third assist. Four point night. So that's going to nullify their power play, but it doesn't really matter. They got one on that one. The rebound control, you just put it put it low. This is an unlucky bounce, James. Pass it off the pads. Listen to him, boo. You can't get set in a scramble like this, and it winds up in the back of the net. The Winterhawks continue to... Who are you want to? Hey. Who are you want to? Effort. Now they're on the home stretch, and the coaching staff has a real opportunity to utilize their bench, rest their star players, and this is critical when you're in a long season. Our goalie can't... <laughs> I mean, this is going to be a 10-10 game. They're scoring the at will again. right now. What a cut and what a snapshot. Completely shift. Wake up, team. Like, do you want to win or do you want to lose? With a two-goal deficit, they have to have desperation and urgency. They'll need two players on the puck at all times. Retrieval to possess the puck is necessary. Yes. Solid check to slow him down. Here's a blast. Denies him on the slapper. Here's a short pass to win. How is that not a penalty? Charging? I'd say. Another. I was going for another rebound. Oh. Get get off the ice now, Ryan. Peterborough's got it in their own zone. Handles the puck from the left side. Broken up with the stick in the defense. A plus offense, I'd say. Are we gonna lose? This is pitiful. These goalies. <laughs> what are they doing? Seven to six? We won. <laughs> what a game. What an energy in the building tonight here, Cheryl. I mean, this thing had a little bit of everything and it really did. Well, in particular in the first period with a number of goals, high-flying offense, but then everyone kind of settled in throughout the game and got back to playing some defensive I mean, they hockey. scored at will. So did we, but still. So do we, and we know what a, they were just... Us as well. From all of us here at EA Sports, I'm James Cebulski. They weren't even getting fancy. They were just shooting it and scoring. We had 31 shots to their 33, 15 hits to their 25. Time on attack was very similar. Passing, we had 73, they had 86. They won 29 face-offs and we won 12. Well, that's not ideal. We only had two penalty minutes. One for two on the power play, that's amazing. They had one power play and 0 for 1. That's a great game. And Orion Gamber was on fire. Yeah, look at this. One go, three assists, 10 shots, but minus one. We had four points, but at a minus one ice rating. That means we were on the ice for five of their goals. Ryan was not, we was not recruited to hockey for his defense. I can tell you all that right now. And this year is so much harder to hit. So I, I can barely put the hit on him. I think we, ha how many hits did we have? Let's actually check. How many did we, we had two hits. That's not bad actually. How many, 
we led our team in hits. Wow. Okay. What a game. 7-6. You, you hate to see that many goals for your goalie, but at the end of the day, if, if your team's not playing defense and they did not really play defense, they had so many open shots. What a game. What a game. Line score lets you know how far you are moving up and down lines. Gain line score by performing well and competing, completing in game challenges. Each position has a primary line score. Okay, for skaters, you can also see your power play, penalty kill, extra attacker status, and shootout status. We, we need some more followers. 6,000? That's it? Ryan's a multi-sport legendary athlete. We just got an A-plus offense. D-plus defense. That's about right. Hey. <laughs> You all that are new here to the Ryan Gamer Career Mode series, don't expect high defensive grades in any sport. So just go ahead and put offense focus on you. We, I want to get an average of a C. I want to pass on defense. So we failed on defense that game. Is, is a deep? No, no, a D plus is a failing, right? That's still passing grade. We'll take it. <laughs> That's isn't that about right? Those of you that have been watching all of the Ride Gamer Crew Mode series, you're like, well, nothing's new on this one. Another another lack of defense game. Well, welcome to Ryan Gamer. <laughs> oh, trait points. All right, let's see what we got. Upgrade your pro skills. Earn trait and specialty points by completing challenges and improving your overall rating. Use these to unlock bonuses and perks to help you play better. Use trait points to unlock dialogue perks. These help you persuade someone in conversation to help you boost likability. So here's the strange thing to me. I mean, we, we did a NHL series. It's either NHL 21 or 22. I can't remember. It might have been 22. But be a pro mode. Although gameplay has had a num number of changes with the way it feels the full pressure system, the goalie fatigue, right? Animations. The gameplay feels really good, but be a pro is the same. That is bizarre to me. Unfortunately, in sports games, a lot of times that happens in the career mode. We definitely want cannon shot. Uh, wrist shot accuracy, it's slap shot, wrist shot power. No, I think we got to go accuracy, right? Let's go marksman level one. Oh, actually, we want speed. We are so slow. Where's the speed? Physical or skating? Yeah, we we need skating because we are so slow. <laughs> we we really need to skate a little bit better. Wait, do we have another skill point? Oh, we do. So let's go speed again, or maybe acceleration actually might be. Let's do. What's our acceleration? Eighty. Let's do acceleration next. How many do we have? Okay, so we have quite a bit already. So let's do speed next. Because I just felt so slow and sluggish on the ice. So let's go all speed now. And then we'll boost them up. But let's see. We got a conversation. Let's see what this conversation is going to be about. That was another incredible performance from you. Is this something your fans should get used to? Absolutely. Don't blink when I'm on the ice or you'll miss my next great play. <laughs> hey, we don't have to worry about our line impacts in the Memorial Cup. We want to get drafted. You've already brought your A game and the tournament's just begin. Are we looking at the next first overall top pick? Yeah, do you really have to ask? Get your autograph now, because it'll be worth a lot pretty soon. Settle down, Ryan. <laughs> settle down. Please settle down. You're not Wayne Gretzky out there, Ryan. So don't act like it. <laughs> He's out here predicting number one draft pick, three assists in his first game, and a goal, four point night. E plus defense. You're not going number one overall, right? I don't know. Anything can happen, right? Anything can happen. But I think what we're going to do is I'm going to play through the other games before the next video. And in the next video, we'll probably play in the Memorial Cup finals and also see the NHL draft. And then in the, in the part three, you'll see Ryan Gamer's NHL debut. This is going to be a lot of fun. Ryan Gamer is sitting 69 overall. We have a long way to go, that's for sure. But four points already in the Memorial Cup. That's great for the Portland Winterhawks here. We face off against Quebec in the next game, who are sitting 1-0. But thank you all for all the support. If you got some enjoyment from this series, drop a like. It really helps the channel. Subscribe for more, and stay tuned for more episodes in the series. I'm going to try to post two to three times a week. You know, probably watch week next few weeks you'll see probably 
three and then after that one or two we'll see kind of how how you all are liking this series we have a lot of career mode series going on at the same time right now right now we have nhl 24 the newest one madden 24 we have ea sports pga tour we have pga 2k 23 and mlb the show 23 so a lot of stuff if you want more career mode episodes tune into the other series it's the same athlete across all the sports subscribe for plenty more content new videos every single day on the gamer ability youtube channel and even more on my second channel gamer ability 2 link in the description to that but i will see you all in the next one as always have a fantastic day everybody